Hey everybody, it's Andrew Cartwright. I had lunch with on Jeff Bezos today, so um, I got some cool stuff to tell you about that. I'm excited. The last three days I've been just entrenched in a, an event uh, with Amazon and also uh, it was really awesome. Thank you everybody that recognized me from the audience and came up and said hello and uh, we're, yeah, it was awesome to see you guys. Thank you so much. It's been a wonderful three days. Um, also, let's talk about stimulus checks, what they'll be used, if they'll be used in this next what's coming recession as economists have weighed in about this. Um, I think you're gonna really like this. It's, it's good news for you. And also, a new rental assistance waiting list for low-income residents. I'm gonna show you how to apply and what to do. And we've got some more money coming up in the world. We've got some, some people that are gonna be getting some money. So I'm gonna talk about that, plus a new stimulus check may be coming your way. We got a lot to cover. I got your back, researching all the stuff. I know, I know I've been busy, but hey, I'm here for you. My name is Andrew Cartwright. Welcome to the show. We talk about stimulus checks for stimulus checks, everything in regards to the economy, what's happening in Washington, maybe a little bit about what's happening with Jeff Bezos and uh, Amazon. And we've got uh, six free stocks you can get in the description. So don't forget to do that. And please, for the YouTube algorithm, would you smash that like button? It really helps out so much and uh, be much appreciated. Thank you in advance for smashing that like button. Also, consider subscribing and hanging out on the channel, and please throw a comment in the comment section. I'd love to know your thoughts. Um, for them, those who have been around a long time, you know why those comments um, matter, um, so it'll be our little secret. Also, uh, if you haven't checked out my real estate program, you definitely want to go check that out. The price goes up to $1,000 after today. It's $99 today. It's 36 videos, a resource list, just I spent 40,000 on this and 45 million in my education to, to be able to deliver this to you. So make sure you check it out. It's in the link. The first two videos are for free. So when to buy, how to buy market cycles. There's going to be a lot of opportunities coming your way very soon, folks. So don't miss out on that. So let's dive into this. One of the big things that has hit so, so dr drama dramatic is what Roe versus Wade. Roe versus Wade was overturned. And 91% of senators confirmed them they were them were men. This is the article. I I know it's like doesn't it sounds weird. Um, this is from the the L.A. Times. Yes, five justices overturned Roe versus Wade. 91% of senators confirming them were men. Hmm, interesting. Uh, from the uh, Los Angeles Times. What do you guys think about this? I think it tears at the fabric. Uh, of something that has long been something that's been on our minds, but not really something that I think anybody thought would change. Um, it's been what 50 years, uh, like a half a century, that we've been under. We've fallen through this. To overturn it just seems like what else could they overturn? When you think about it, right? Love to know your thoughts. Please put in the comments um, what you guys think. Seems like you know it's weird. We legalize marijuana in most of the states. And then we uh, outlaw, we're, gonna, we're overturning Roe versus Wade. Interesting. We've got the likelihood of the new stimulus checks using, used in the next recession. Economics way, economists weigh on, on why they think it's going to be that way. A new um, uh, residential assistance program. And Biden Democrats are really scared as hell a bit about inflation. Also, they want to make sure that people get money. Um, as well, because they know if a check could help them win the elections in November, which is just around the corner, folks. My name is Andrew Cartwright, and I hope you guys are having a fantastic Friday. You guys are the best audience. It was so incredible to have you come up and say hello to me, both at Resort World and at Aria and also over at Caesars. Thank you guys so much. Um, and you're in Vegas, so it was kind of cool to see you. Anyway, um, really enjoyed the conversations with you. Uh, you mean the world to me, and that's why I do this, is to help as many people as possible with their money on a finance channel about how to get access to money. My goal is always to provide you with government private money 
For yourself, loved ones, make sure you check out the loans down below, up to 12 different programs. I also fund businesses, so hit me up in the, hit me up with an email if you're interested in owning your own business at some point. Um, I plan to finance those and put up, put up money, help you out, um, and buy companies together. Like That's the goal of that. I have a second channel that dives deeper into that. So I think the best thing to do, having started 32 companies in 17 industries, is help people you know, pull themselves out of the mud. So, but first, the stimulus checks sent out during the pandemic were widely popular, right? Nearly four in five voters were in support of direct payments to American families. Four out of five people. Not sure who that one was that was against it, but four out of five people. We don't agree on anything four out of five, folks. We just don't. Um, our presidential elections are usually a 1% difference. 2% difference. It's not much. So that's pretty big when majority of the public wants these, like 20%, 80% of the public. And Democrats and Republicans alike rally behind the policy in our faces. An incredibly rare sight to see in Washington as two parties that, you know, can't agree even like where to eat lunch, right? Because it means something. Not kidding. These guys don't get along if you've ever been to Washington. But they do. It's just a joke. But the problem, the joke is on us. Still, the checks were not without controversy. Almost all criticism, there was tons of criticism about the rounds of payments and what they should target the financial struggling Americans. And the cash led, at least in part, to runaway inflation, as some people say. Needless, nevertheless, though, the popularity of the payments are finding that their reduced poverty, promoted spending, uh, which is good for the economy, means that likely become a tool to pull out the government in the next recession. We now have a tool to be able to get money to people to help them and help the economy to stimulate it, which may be coming soon, experts are saying. Claudia Shimon, a macro uh, economist, policy consultant, and former Federal Reserve economist said, quote, I expect stimulus checks to be used again. They worked, end quote. Hmm. I'll say it again. Quote, I expect stimulus checks to, to be used again. They worked, end quote. This is from someone who advised in the, uh, the Federal Reserve to help people, you know, um, pros calling. What do you guys think? Can you see that they're coming out with a new stimulus check and, and do you think it'll support you? I know a lot of, a lot of you are frustrated and feel like it's never coming. Others have gotten checks in states that I've told you about. But meanwhile, New Jersey is opening the state rental assistance lottery for nearly two weeks in July, which I covered, that low-income elderly residents, families, people with disabilities, and those expecting, uh, experiencing homelessness, this so-called, quote, SRAP voucher, end quote, yes, SRAP voucher, subsidize a tenant rent, a voucher holder would spend between 25 to 40 percent of their income on rent and the voucher would cover the difference. This voucher can be used only in New Jersey by New Jersey residents unlike Section 8 or Housing Choice vouchers which can be used across the country. Again, they want you to use part of yours and then once you get to where you can't afford it, if rent is unaffordable, they'll pay the difference. The state will choose 4,000 applications through a lottery or 1,000 applicants each from the following category. Elderly head of household must be 62 years or older. A family head of household is 18 years or older or an emancipated adult with or without children. Disabled head of household or spouse and permanently disabled. Homeless, a household lacking a quote, fixed, regular, adequate, nightly residence, end quote. I wonder if this means you're in a weekly, if that counts. I really hope this helps as far as getting you information about getting you some decent housing or at least covering the skyrocketing costs of everything. And finally, soaring inflation, inflation will trigger an automatic increase in California's minimum wage next year. Governor Gavin Newsom administration announced Thursday the minimum wage will jump to $15.50 per hour January 1st, the highest of any state. That's an increase from 15 per hour for companies will have more than 25 employees and $14 an hour for companies with 
25 employees or less. California lawmakers voted to increase the minimum wage to $15 per 2016, uh, but the increase was phased in over several years. The law says that the minimum wage must increase to $15.50 per hour for everyone if the increased by more than 7%. Then, yesterday, the California Department of Finance said they project inflation for 2022 fiscal year, which ends June 30th, will be 7.6% higher than the year before. This is triggering the increase. Official inflation figures won't be final until September, but Newsom administration believes that the growth will be more than enough to trigger the automatic increase. That's great news, though. More money for those who work hard and deserve it. What do you think about this? Um, and what do you think is going to happen in your neck of the woods? I'd love to know. I checked out a conference and uh, was at a conference. Remars is what it's called. It's about robotics, um, uh, robotics, uh, automation, uh, machine learning, and space. It's amazing. Bezos is doing so much in space and robotics is unbelievable. You have to check out um, what Amazon is doing because it's actually fabulous. Anyway, it is Friday, June 24th. I hope you guys are doing fantastic. My name is Andrew Cartwright. Thanks for sticking around. Um, please let me know if uh, what movie you're going to go see this weekend, if you're going to go watch one. Take care. Love you.